fans here today, I've noticed they're here just to see you guys. But for the fans that haven't and are going to be seeing you guys all summer long, where are you out of? Uh, Dayton, Ohio. You smirked and you said that. Yeah. That's a, uh, I don't know why. I just smiled, I guess. We're now California boys, you know. We're a little out of our element with these palm trees everywhere. But <laughs> you guys spend so much time on tour now, you don't even know where you are anymore. We're not really from anywhere anymore, you know. It's like, we're, we're on the road so much, it's just never go home, you know, so. Since it's the first day of tour, we just want to get basic fans for the questions, so don't get mad if you've already heard these before, but uh, where'd you guys get the title of the band from? Uh, the book, before the book was the bestseller in the movie, and then, uh, <laughs> and it's the yeah, we just, I don't know, we thought it was catchy or whatever, and then when it got big, it just ended up sucking and for the worse, but whatever. So that's one of the things where then the movie comes out and you guys are like, fuck. Yeah, yeah. pretty much. <laughs> Because we, uh, I think we had already just like signed to the label, and then we saw like, oh, they're making a movie. Like, oh no, like what are we gonna? This is gonna be the rest of our careers now, is answering about the movie, you know. But what are you gonna do? It could be worse. Which is exactly what you're doing right now. Sorry, but I preferenced that by saying I was gonna do that. Uh, did you guys ever say fuck it? We'll change the name. I can't swear. Did you guys ever say you know what? We might change the name. Uh, no, we not I think it's because we're lazy and we're just like, you know, that takes so much work, so we've just stuck with the name and whatever, just get flack from it or whatever. What are you guys going to do on your off time? Uh, probably just so many bands I want to see this year, you know, like, uh, I want to see Azalea Dying, Every Time I Die, Day to Remember, it's just like so many different bands I want to go watch, so, I don't know, it's kind of cool, it's like a free ticket almost, you know, so just walk around and watch bands. Uh, you guys gamers, skaters, bikers, any of that going on in the parking lot this summer? You're right, be a man. I don't have my bike with me, but uh, I do at home. I, I didn't really bring anything, I think I'm just going to hang out. <laughs> We're going to write after this, I think, and uh, we're filming for a DVD right now. I think we might do like a re-release of our CD with the DVD, so that should be pretty cool. We got tons of footage, so it should be pretty funny. So have you been writing right now, getting ready for it? or? Uh, yeah, Chris, our guitarist, he uh, just spilled on my foot. Uh, he, uh, he's been working around, he, uh, he writes a bunch of riffs and puts them on his computer and stuff, so we kind of have a bank and we go in and withdraw as we write music, but uh, we haven't really composed any complete songs or anything, we're hopefully going to just do that after Warped. <laughs> Devil Wears Prada, the whole tour, they're on the Hurley stage. Uh, Hurley.com stage or the Hurley stage? Fans are going to get confused about this all summer long. No, it's Hurley, though. The blimp, the blimp thingy. The blimp stage. The blimp. The blimp. So we've renamed the Hurley stage the blimp stage. It's official. It's now the blimp stage for the summer. And you can see Devil Wears Prada every day. You know, put a banner up. Blimp stage. Ah! 